I've had a Umi DG Power 3 for nearly two years. It was a great phone. Unfortunately, AT&T will no longer support it, so I purchased a Power 5. The Power 5 doesn't seem to match the performance of the Power 3. It lags at times and some apps load, process slowly. Hopefully an update will fix this. The Power 3's camera is definitely better. I got lots of compliments on the pictures that I took with the Power 3, especially pictures taken in low light. Not thinking that will be the case with the Power 5. The other aspects of the phones are basically equal. Power 5 positives, nice screen. I like the side fingerprint reader. Speaker quality seems a bit better. 128 gigs of storage will be nice. I've read that it works with Verizon, I am going to try that. It'll sure miss my Power 3. Update. I set up my Power 3 with Mint Mobile, so I returned the Power 5. I bought this phone as a secondary fourth phone for Pokemon Go almost exclusively. Having multiple accounts makes rating easy, and I wanted something with Android 10 for longevity, good battery life and just decent performance. Click link in description for more reviews.